This is the De Leon episode 87, Elf Bowling, Hawaiian Vacation. The De Leon is brought to you by 11.2 at E-L-E-V-E-N, the number 2.com. I'm Matt Ryan, and here is your De Leon. When you think about the holidays that just passed, you may be filled with warm memories of eggnog, family reunions, presents, and lights. For a lucky sum that managed to come across Elf Bowling Hawaiian Vacation, it was memories of knocking down elves with giant bowling balls. That's right. Elf Bowling Hawaiian Vacation is a game like none other. It has been around for quite some time. In fact, I believe even in the 90s, Elf Bowling was around. But this game, a little different, puts a little twist onto it. And one of the most interesting bowling games we here at the De Leon have ever seen, Mumbo Jumbo has created a gaming experience that combines the time-honored sport with runaway elves from Santa's workshop. Your job is to outbowl various opponents and take out as many of these bothersome elves as possible. Graphics in this game are unusually limiting. There really isn't a lot in the way of resolution settings. For example, there are none. You can set the quality to low, medium, or high, and that's pretty much it. Now, beyond switching from full screen to windowed mode, you're not going to find a lot of support here in the way of graphics. The game looks great, though the graphics are what you would expect from a typical Flash game, which is basically where this game came from in the first place. Now, any number of websites out there carry this game. You can find it on Yahoo Games, on Big Fish Games, on, on various other sites out there. It's pretty readily available for a one-hour demo. If you want to try it out, you can try it for one hour. That's absolutely free. I promise you, after an hour, you'll be kind of hooked. It's very addictive. It's like crack. It's a little strange in that way. Now, what makes this bowling game especially different from all the others is their system of advantages and disadvantages you can use to help you. Here's what I'm talking about. By rolling your ball over coin-shaped pieces in the alley, you can gain advantages during your next turn, such as a bigger ball, a rocket that guarantees a strike if you aim it correctly, a rock ball that splits and makes you immune to oil slicks and other various things that your opponent may sling at you during the course of the game. You can also sabotage your opponent using oil slicks, as mentioned before, gravel that grinds their ball down in size considerably, barricades that block the ball and knock it in the gutter, and many other different little tricks. Now your opponent uses them towards you, you use them towards the opponent. It's kind of fair in that way. These extras make for a wacky kind of bowling that breaks the traditional bowling game monotony. The elves constantly shout out phrases that directly reference annoying internet memes such as chocolate rain. They do this to intimidate and annoy you and it works. It is very annoying, especially when they pass gas at you as you get ready to take your turn. The elves have a voice that reminds me a lot of foamy. If you remember those foamy cartoons that in themselves was a meme, uh, that's exactly what these elves sound like. It's kind of annoying, but at the same time, you get used to it. It's almost like watching Alvin and the Chipmunks. Controls are simple. You move your mouse cursor left or right to set your stance, hold down and push the mouse to set your speed and power, and continue aiming the ball as it makes its way down the aisle. You have control of your ball from start to finish, which comes in handy when your opponent uses dirty little tricks, like setting up a giant magnet. Overall, the experience is exceptional for the price. I intend to play the game for about an hour to three hours, and I ended up playing it for about eight hours total. Uh, it was very addicting. Uh, the game uh, will be in rotation at our house for some time to come. It's very good effort on the part of Mumbo Jumbo Games, it's called Elf Bowling Hawaiian Vacation, and I recommend you pick it up. You can pick it up on Steam, Direct to Drive, or any other fine uh, downloading retailers out there. This has been your Daily Own. That's PWN. For a written review of this and other games, please head over to dailyown.com. This is Matt Ryan, and I'm out. Good game, no rematch. <laughs>